struggled the first year to put in an incredible culture. And I said, we don't want to be Houston, but we want to take the dynamics of Houston and be the Eastern version of them, their toughness, the way they play with reckless abandonment. And I think Houston may have had a sub-500 record the first year, and then they were top 20 and top 10 every other year. And our guys were really tough and very aggressive on offense tonight. Uh, at the end of the game, we made some mistakes, but these guys were flat out exhausted. I had to call that time out just to get him to rest. I'm proud of Chris because I've been trying to get him to shoot the open shot because he's a very good shooter. And it's going to set up the drives for him. I'm really proud of Jordan because he's getting better and better, except with catching the ball with one hand. Um, outside of that, he played a great game, and he's showing what he is because he's getting used to the rest of the guys. So I'm proud of both these guys. I've said it many, many times, and for you guys from out of town, this is going to be a, a Wharton grad. This, he already graduated from Harvard. And they wanted to add to their resume of getting a great education by coming to St. John's. And it's, it's no doubt about it. Those other schools are fine, middle of the road academic institutions, but now <laughs> they've got something special. So I'm proud of both of these guys. They, they really helped us get a great victory, and we beat a tremendous team tonight. This tournament, I want to thank ESPN and Charleston Shriners for giving us this type of competition this early in the season. It's flat out great. To finish in third, two and one. I've been to Maui where we lost the first game. I've been to the Battle of Atlantis where we lost and came out two and one. And I would 